Zilliqa biggest breakout 2020 should you buy now welcome back guys it's crypto rocker from rockstar trading channel in today's video guys i'll be sharing with you my thoughts on Zilliqa so i'll be sharing with you a strategy that you can look to get into if you want to buy Zilliqa i'll share with you from a higher time frame that Zilliqa is at resistance and what i want to see to buy again also guys i'll be looking at some news some price predictions some of the reasons why zilliqa pumped and share with you my thoughts on zilliqa overall so guys zilliqa had a huge breakout if you guys have been following my channel i made it top five videos i make this video once a once a month at the start of the month i talked about zilliqa's huge breakout hopefully you guys watched that video and made some money on it also guys i updated you on zilliqa and so in the YouTube videos, I share with the exact strategies to get in and in the group, I share with the exact price levels of when to buy and when to sell. You can see I made this post of when to take profit in Zilliqa when it was at resistance. And since then, guys, Zilliqa has almost pulled down about 30 percent or so. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button to get up to date. I will be doing a live stream once I get to 10K subscribers. So thank you all for subscribing supporting me in this journey so Zilliqa guys uh, let's have a look at Zilliqa so Zilliqa had a nice structure and couple of reasons why Zilliqa broke out I found is the staking so Zilliqa had Binance staking and KuCoin staking I think those were the two main reasons for this pump and one thing I did like about Zilliqa is it didn't just go up in one candle like theta and it pump and dump so that is better but that doesn't mean that Zilliqa is overextended the RSI you can see in Zilliqa is very high. There was huge divergence. Even the weekly RSI was extremely high. And the reason why I made that post in, in the group of selling Zilliqa was it was at 236 Fibonacci, previous resistance, extremely high level of RSI divergence on the daily. You could still be shorting it. These are some of the trades we took. And um, again, I didn't buy Zilliqa at the bottom and made 300%. I took a trade here we sold it there's two other trading opportunities i think this one we shared it live on the previous youtube video as well so hopefully you made some money on it the important thing is guys not to wait for this pumps i mean zilliqa has pumped we see cryptocurrencies pump and dump a lot so it's not to just there are some good coins if you like them you can huddle you can watch my investing videos to see which coins i'm holding but usually what i found what's made me money is going in from coin to coin looking at trading strategies you can use my trading strategy or you can use your own trading strategy i'll leave the links below if you're interested in my trading strategy but it's really important to have a strategy and not just trade by you know price because uh, you fancy a coin or you think is going up and foaming because one of the things i mean uh, I talked about is best not to buy now because people are FOMOing. We need to get in before people start FOMOing because we don't want to get dumped on. We want to get in, and you can see exactly when we were trading Zilliqa back since 25th of May, the exact price levels we were looking to buy. So, if you have missed Zilliqa, how can you get in? So, Zilliqa is in a downtrend now, and uh, what I like is it's a four hours getting oversold, first time since the huge breakout, and it is coming to the daily moving average. So, I do think Zilliqa will potentially have a bounce now. So, uh, this is a tradable opportunity. Uh, one of the examples that I can give you is Nano, which pulled back into it, hadn't pumped like Zilliqa, so it's a different setup, but you can see pulled back into the daily moving average, then had a nice little trade. And and on the hourly it gave exactly pull, nice pullbacks using our trading strategy i'll leave the links below if you're interested so that's what i'm going to be looking at zilliqa so if you have me zilliqa please don't fall more in if we get back above the moving averages and gives you a pullback you can take a trade this is only a trading opportunity for those big breakouts we need to close above 300 if zilliqa closes above 300 i think zilliqa can do another huge pump of another potentially 80 100 percent move so roughly that is the strategy that i'm looking at for zilliqa so hopefully you guys have enjoyed it and if you're new you might need some help uh, there's a course available in the group and i'm posting every day not just for stocks i do live streams as well and i post about stock market we're looking at stock market trades forex trades and there's a unit section available to help you get started with trading if you are new to trading there's a course introduction available i'll leave the links below if you're interested but please don't fomo in guys if you trade with FOMO it's a quick way of losing money and we have seen this before huge pumps newbies get excited 
loads of people make YouTube videos and you can see uh, loads of people making Zilliqa videos now <laughs> they used to make XRP videos now Zilliqa and Ada they always seem to move from coin to coin so that is what I'm looking at now from a higher time frame if we bounce and fail like this then I won't be interested in Zilliqa I think it will drop to around almost 618 level if Zilliqa can hold at the daily moving average and like Neo break and have a close above here I think Zilliqa will have another move up I have looked at news for Zilliqa and it looks like main people are talking about prices rather than um, anything more news coming out like staking or partnership or any adoption sort of news that can help the price move up news always helps price move up and if we look at the uh, Zilliqa USD chart that is the chart that I shared uh, on 10th of June to take profit if you took Zilliqa you can see exactly where it was um, Zilliqa has pulled back from there as well it is a very similar sort of chart to the Zilliqa BTC chart and they're both coming into some support levels so we'll have to see if this support holds so hopefully you guys enjoyed that video and then um, I, I did say I'll make a long-term Zilliqa video on my thoughts on Zilliqa fundamentally I have looked into it is very similar to most coins that most platform co platform coins that make claims uh, if you're interested if I get maybe a th 2,000 views I will make a video on Zilliqa fundamentally this weekend if I have got enough time so hopefully you guys enjoyed it that's my strategy uh, if you have enjoyed it guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button if you want to take your trading to the next level you can check out our group for 30 pounds you get access to all of that live stream updates and a great uh, community of traders and there's a big yearly discount as well for 160 pound you can get the whole yearly subscription as well so check out if you're interested if not guys all my all i ask from you guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button and i'll see you guys soon with another great video